Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie and I'm blind. Here, let me show you something that I use on a daily basis. So this is my white cane. It's red on the bottom and right on top with a rubber handle and a string. Not everyone's cane looks like that and that's okay. And no, I don't have a guide dog. I do, however, have a pet name. And this is Lily. She's seven. She likes going outside, going for car rides, and sleeping. Her favorite things are being petted, hot dogs, and her toys. So come join us as we show you what it's like living life as a blind person. What's that? Oh. You thought Willow was blind too? Nope, Willow's not blind. It's just me. What? Oh, uh, okay, fine. So come join me and I'll show you what it's like living life as a blind person. But Willow's tagging along too. Sometimes. Most of the time. Evening. It is One Take Sunday. If you are unfamiliar how One Take Sunday works, it is where I record for as long as possible and whatever happens, happens. The only edited parts are the intro and the outro. I am not editing this part absolutely at all. So, yeah. Let's hop into it, I guess. I don't know. She literally won't stop barking at me. Why are you barking? Why are you barking? Oh no, you're gonna lay down like you're a cute girl. So, I just kind of took it easy today. It was a lot cooler today, or a little cooler today than it was yesterday, so I did not have the window open. I wanted to have the window open, but I woke up and my hands were icicles, so I had to close the window. And Honestly, I am so glad that Christmas is over. I don't know what it is. I just, I was kind of into the Christmas spirit, I guess, but not really. Like, I didn't want to celebrate Christmas. I don't want to open presents. I don't want to give presents. I just, basically, well, that's not true. I wanted to give presents and put up the tree. But that only happened a couple of weeks ago, which is why I was shopping at the last minute. Because usually I shop, I have all my shopping done in like the end of October or the beginning of November. And that's how it's always been until both of my parents died. And then I just didn't care anymore. Like I didn't buy anybody presents. I didn't do anything. And I just, I don't know, I just, I'm glad Christmas was, is over. I must have said Christmas was over, as if Christmas is back again. No, don't say that. Anyway, I've been playing with Willow today. We have played with her chicken. She has basically bitten off its head. until its head is almost gone and it's like holding on by a thread <laughs> which okay I don't blame her that chicken was really annoying but she cut out or she not cut out she <laughs> bit out all the squeaky bits so he shouldn't be annoying anymore is the chicken annoying oh look at her roll over on her side and she got in bed with me earlier and was laying next to me, cuddling me. And then she got up and then she got back in bed and laid down on her pillow. You're so cute. Yeah, you're so cute. Are you a cute big girl? Huh? <laughs> I was planning on working on trying to get my cat necklace put back together because I still want to wear it. It's not a Christmas necklace. I just wanted to wear it. And I am realizing that because I went through my jewelry, 
I am realizing that I have a lot of crosses, and I don't really wear crosses much. And I don't know why I have so many, and a lot of them are, like, really similar to each other. And it's really weird. So, I'm probably gonna go through those at some point and try and figure out why I have so many and what I can do with them. Because I have this plan to get rid of a bunch of my old jewelry because it's like cheap jewelry. I don't have any expensive jewelry. I know there's all kinds of rumors going around that I am really rich, but I don't have money. None of my jewelry is expensive. I think the most expensive jewelry I got was jewelry that I bought for prom and it was from Claire's. So, I don't have any expensive jewelry, so I'm going to go through some of my crosses maybe tomorrow and try to figure out what I can get rid of and I'm going to put all of my earrings in one box so they're not all in my big wooden box and I'm going to move all my necklaces out of that box and into the big wooden box that I have on my dresser where my earrings are currently residing. That's the plan. We'll see what happens. Tomorrow I'm also going to try to vacuum the floor. I have said that for weeks and I just never did it. But I am definitely going to do that tomorrow because my bedroom floor needs it so badly. And I need to go through my jewelry because I think there's a lot of rusted crosses in there and I'm like, why do I have those? Ew. So, anyway, I think this is going to be it for today's video, so I am going to go ahead and say goodnight, and I will see you tomorrow. Good night, everybody. <laughs>